Well, the Mighty Sailor Band ditches the drunken sailor stereotype with a highbrow kind of halftime show. Gotta love Marco's tosses to these things. Gotta love them. All right, well, Marco Lomano is going to share the sounds of Sarasota's High's marching band in this week's Friday Football Fever Band of the Week. When you listen to the Mighty Sailor Band's halftime in 2022, they're quite the classy group of sailors. A sailor symphony, as band director Chris Lieber told me, from Beethoven to Stravinsky. But sometimes to get that delicate sound, you have to swim through some nasty currents. As drum major Addison Sherrard told me, This band is really used to adversity here. <laughs> Let's put aside the obvious adversity with the band losing around half a dozen practices due to Hurricane Ian, and let's go back a year. Addison and wind captain Stephen Dean told me one of their props in their 2021 show was this big bridge. And on a competition at a different school, it was one of their first times using it because Sarasota High's new turf made the bridge impossible to pull onto their own field. And their marching shoes are very smooth on the bottom. So walking on really smooth wood, everybody just down the bridge. I never really had that issue, but I, I did remember <laughs> looking back at the video and I was like, is that Addison sliding down the ramp? I'm like, she's not moving, is she? Now, despite turf and bridge issues, they ranked best music in their class at the state championship. We have extreme loyalty to our craft. With an unusually small band last year and a host of new faces this year, Leaper made the marching aspect mandatory instead of voluntary. This is to get more kids involved and get them hooked into what being a mighty sailor is all about. There's always somebody new that's coming in next year, whether they're a freshman, a sophomore, because some people don't even know about band coming in. They'll come in in their sophomore year and we're like, hey, you should have been here freshman year, you know? Once they have their first season and they have that first competition or that first football game, they tend to immediately fall in love with marching band and all of those worries and insecurities just kind of fall away over time. Reporting from Sarasota with your Band of the Week, Marco Lomano, SNN, the Suncoast News Network. And the Mighty Sailor Band will perform at the annual Marching Performance Assessment it's this Saturday at Manatee High. And details to see them and nearly all of the bands in the area can be found on our website, snntv.com. Yep. So if you've been paying attention to Marco's Bands of the Week yeah. that he's been, you know, highlighting, doing a really great job of that, now's your chance to uh, catch them in the flesh. That's amazing yeah. talent, for yeah. sure. Really, I, I never was able to kind of... I was a choir geek, I was a thespian, drama nerd, but I never athlete. got into the, yeah. yeah, I never got into the band, I was kind of an athlete too, but not, not to your level, but <laughs> I never got into the band stuff, so it's really cool to get that behind yeah. the scenes look to see how they set all that up and the kind of training and, and um, determination it takes to put some of these shows on, so mm -hmm. 